Today's How to Kick Ass in Sales with me, Kerry Sullivan, is all about how to develop self-confidence. All right, so someone asked me today, how is it that I have self-confidence? And the fact of the matter is, I'm just like anyone else out there. There's certain times that I don't always have self-confidence and there's certain things I'll do that I don't have self-confidence in. So if you go and look at my videos, I've, this is like 1.30 today or whatever, and you go back and look at my ones in the beginning, I wasn't as confident for sure. And I, I get a little bit more, a little bit more confident every day. And one of the things in terms of developing self-confidence is just that as practice it's doing something every single day so you know if you want to get better at taking free throw shots go out there and take 10 a day or whatever just practice on it every single day you know visualization can be very good for it too but going out there and practicing the skills as well with visualization can be something that can be extremely extremely powerful you know I talk a lot about mindset and uh, hypnosis well not, I shouldn't say hypnosis as much as NLP tactics I've talked about as well and one of the things you can do to develop immediate self-confidence is ask yourself better questions right as Tony Robbins says if you want to get better answers ask yourself better questions so how can you develop self-confidence right here right now right because as a sales professional you know what it's like or an entrepreneur or anyone else out there when you're in the zone in anything that you're doing it and you feel like you can't be beaten and you're just flowing everything's going and you feel good look good taste good everything is going great right how is it that you get into that state when you need to because that's what it takes in order for you to really perform at your best right it's like Peyton Manning or any of the top athletes out there they don't go into a pressure situation and be like I don't know if I can make this they believe that they can make it because it's a state so how do you get in that state it's really simple I'm gonna break it down to you right here right now so listen to me watch me and feel me on this right now so this is how you do it so the first thing you start thinking in your mind is what would, you know, if you're in a sales situation, you can apply this to whatever you want. What would the best salesperson in the world, what would they be thinking? What would they be saying to themselves right here and right now? And you start thinking about those things. So I'll, I'll walk through it. So I would be thinking to myself when I have to do this, I'm going to sell this person. I am the best salesman in the world. And if they can't be sold, they can't be sold. No one's going to do it except for me. Right, I can do this, I'm the best one out there in the world, no one has more skills than me or more confidence than me in order to do this, right? So I start thinking those thoughts and I'll do that for about a minute until I start kind of, you know, start getting that vibe, that energy, I start feeling a little bit better. So then I start thinking, how would that person be breathing? How would the best sales professional in the world be breathing? right and start breathing like that person whatever you think that may be that gets you in that state start breathing that way so it's just strong breaths in deep from the belly just like that confident best salesperson in the world breath and then you get into how would that person be feeling right what would be the the emotions in their body in their chest you know how would their legs their arms how would they be feeling right and then you get into how would they be holding their body right would they be holding their head down absolutely not their head would be up right they'd be walking in there like a superhero kicking the door down like John Wayne right and then they'd be right there right now so when you put all those things together you've changed your state so you've gone from feeling like I don't know if I can make it to boom yes let's do this let's go and get it let's go get at it so that's how you can do that now what I suggest is you do that right what I suggest is you do that and then practice as well because it'll get a lot easier for you to get in that state so you know practice those game time situations like that and also practicing to put yourself in situations where you know you're gonna have a hard time right where well, you know you're gonna have a hard time because as the African runners out there say the Kenyans say I've said this before train hard race easy it's the same exact thing 
in selling, in business, in whatever it is you want to be good at. Train hard so it's easy come game time to go out there and get the job done. So that is how you develop the self-confidence. So number one is practice every single day. Just go out there and practice every single day. Number two, listen to me and feel me on this, is going through all those things I said. So what would the, what would the top salesperson or athlete or whatever it is that you're trying to get in that state of, what would the top person in the world be thinking? What would they be feeling? What would be the emotions they're feeling through their body? How would they be breathing, right? Are they breathing from high in the chest, in the middle of the belly? What is the, the breathing pattern? Start mimicking that, right? Start mimicking that type of feeling. And then how would they be holding their body? No, there would they be have their head down, shoulders slumped over? No, <laughs> no, they would be in that superhero position, right? Going through there like that. So that is the key to having self confidence. And as my tip of the day, hope you enjoy this. Hey, if you like this, please share it. Please feel free to make any of your comments. And if you like this, subscribe to it. And I'll see you on the next video. I really appreciate you watching this. I really thank you guys. You're awesome. And uh, feel free to shoot me a message. I love to talk to you guys. So that's it. I'll see you on the next How to Kick Ass in Sales. Minana.